Yeah? Start filming who we're doing. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> I made it, I'm famous! <laughs> Are we surprised that as per usual my hair is annoying me? No, because that is a daily occurrence. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited for today's video and I know there's a few people out there watching this as well who are also really excited. Um, but as you'll be able to tell in the title, I got some of my friends to pick my outfits from Pretty Little Thing. Um, I didn't give them any sort of occasion or budget or anything. I just said, pick me an outfit. They picked them, basically sent them to Josh. Josh ordered the things so that I didn't see what they were. Um, and then Josh spoke to my dad this morning for my dad to sort out the outfits into separate bags for each person. Basically so that I haven't seen anything, I don't know what people have got me. Um, so you'll see my first reaction and everything on camera. So yeah, big thanks to Josh and my dad for doing the kind of behind the scenes things. And also obviously to the girls who picked out these outfits for me because obviously the video wouldn't be possible without them. So yeah, without me blabbering on anymore, I am so excited to see what they've picked me. Um, yeah, let's just get started. I'm gonna start with Daisy's. Um, she said to wear this outfit with any of my vans, which is quite a positive sign. Um, if you know me, you know I wear my vans with pretty much everything. I have about four or five different pairs. And to know that this outfit is gonna work with my vans and suit them is quite positive, like, it looks quite positive for me. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. The colors are looking perfect so far. We have got something that is white. Um, white corset detail, okay, interesting. White corset detail jumper dress. This is sounding positive. Get rid of, was that thunder or a trailer? So, okay, this is looking nice. So we have a big jumper dress. I'm literally wearing a t-shirt dress today. I wear t-shirt dresses all the time. Don't actually think I've ever tried a jumper dress. So I'm excited to try this. I did actually order a jumper dress the other day so that is a good sign it's this like white jumper dress We've got this corset tie detail in the middle which means it's going to cinch in on the waist and look quite flattering i think which again is a positive sign and then to go with it we have this gray black thing i think this might be a bag i can't get into it i haven't read the label for this one so i've got no idea what it's going to look like but it's looking like a little bra i think i might know what this is Okay, yeah, okay. Okay, so here we've just got this like little black bag, nice, simple and basic, she knows me well, and this will actually work really well with my checkerboard vans, which are my most worn vans, because we've got the black and the white with them. So I am very excited to try this out. Very simple and basic, but that is very me. This is cute, like a nice little, little bag. <laughs> okay, that is a good start. I am excited about that. I don't know who to go for next. Whose is this? Okay. We'll go with Eve next. Um, I am excited. Okay, we've got a bit of colour, but not, not too much colour, a good amount. This is looking a little bit patterned, but a kind of, it almost looks a bit like a Dalmatian print, which is something I'm very into at the moment. Nude mesh tie-dye print ruched bodycon dress. This is sounding so good. The colours are looking good. And also, the fact it's bodycon, big 10 out of 10. Where is this going? What? I'm a bit confused. Okay, I'm now seeing it. Is it like a cow neck? Did I say cow neck? I'm not sure if I did. It doesn't say whether it's a cow neck or not, but it kind of looks like it. So, little dress like this, and then it's got a little bit of like a kind of frilly hem. And okay, and then it goes like ruched there if that makes sense this one will definitely be easier to see on but i'm actually quite liking this i'm thinking like for a night out kind of thing this is very is it navy i thought it was black okay so it's like nude with like kind of dark navy prints on i actually quite like that i thought it was gonna be black but that's quite cute actually not something i would normally pick but having said that I do actually really like this. I think this will look really nice on and I feel like this is something that Eve would wear that I'd be like, oh my God, that looks so nice. Um, so I'm quite glad she's got me something that's kind of like her kind of style because I love her style. So I think this is gonna look good. Okay, this is going so well. I'm really, really impressed so far. Let's hope the others don't let me down. I don't think they will though. Well done Eve and Daisy. Great start girls, love that. Okay, I'm gonna go with Hannah next. I'm gonna leave her lying to last. Just she has to wait a bit longer, have a bit of suspense and drama. I'm not even gonna look in the bag. I'm just gonna pull out. I think it's just one item, so I'll be all right. Oh my God. I think Hannah and Eve have potentially 
got me the same dress with just a different pattern on. If they have, I'm pretty impressed with that. Um, Hannah and Eve are both friends from uni and then Alana and Daisy are both my friends from home. So if my two uni mates have done pretty similar dresses, I'm gonna be quite like proud of them for doing that. Okay, let's have a look then. I feel like polka dots is very Hannah. Like looking at this, just the pattern, makes me think of Hannah. Um, so I'm excited, I'm really curious as to if yeah, oh my god, okay, it's the exact same dress, I actually can't believe they've done this, exact same dress, just a different pattern. Okay, so obviously not going to have as much to talk about as this one because I basically spoke about in the last one. It's got the same rouge detailing, the little hem on the bottom, and again, it's the same dress. But yeah, I actually can't believe my two Leeds girls have picked the same thing, just a different pattern. I think that is actually really clever of them. I'm actually so impressed. I, oh yeah, nothing else to say about that. I'm a bit speechless. Okay, and lastly we have Alana. Um, one of her items literally went out of stock just before Josh ordered it. So she had to change one of the items to something kind of similar. But what I will do is I'll speak to her after this video, find out what the original item Item was and I'll put a picture up on screen as I'm talking about it so you can kind of see what her original outfit idea was. I still am in shock about the same dresses, I'm so impressed. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is in my wish list. I was gonna order this and this was gonna be in my next pretty little thing haul and Alana's got me it. Oh my god. I don't actually know what to say. <laughs> I've never, what? I literally watched a Pretty Little Thing haul either yesterday or the day before, saw someone get this t-shirt and was like, oh my God, I want that. But this stuff was all ordered before then. This parcel was sat in my room with this top in it whilst I was watching that video and I had no idea. I actually, I can't believe it. Right, I'm actually gonna open it now because I've just been sat here in shock at the fact that Alana has literally read my mind about this. Um, I'm gonna show you what it is. So it's this gray t-shirt um, which says Space Jam on it. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know who Space Jam is, but the girl whose video I was watching this in, if that makes any sense, she said it's like a 90s TV program and I'm an 01 baby, so I probably just missed it. But I really liked the color of this. It's like a nice dark kind of gray and I quite liked the design on it. I just thought it was quite cool and I like the colors on it, but it's not too colorful for me either because of the gray background. And it's kind of, I mean, it's not similar to the top that I'm wearing today, but this is obviously like kind of a plain color t-shirt with a little kind of design on it. And that is literally basically what this is. I'm honestly so impressed that she got me this because I literally was gonna order this anyway. So now I don't have to. So thank you very much, Alana. There was something else in this bag to go with it. So, oh, brilliant. This is incredible. She's got me some black cycling shorts, which is exactly what I would wear with that. I was curious as to what she was gonna pair this with because for me, I would wear this with cycling shorts um, as kind of like a t-shirt dress type thing. But I didn't know if she was gonna style it with something else. But she obviously, ooh, stuck to my hand. <laughs> Get off. But she obviously knows me very well and knows how I like to wear my outfit. So some simple black cycling shorts. I'm now actually really curious to see what she was originally planning on getting me because this is pretty perfect to me. So I'm guessing maybe she was planning to get me a different top potentially, but this top is incredible. So I'm just sat here looking at all the things that the girls have got me and I'm actually so impressed. Like I was a bit worried that there might be a couple of things that I wasn't too sure on, but I'm actually really liking everything. I like how I've got some things that I would definitely would 100% wear and also some things that I wouldn't normally pick, but I think are actually gonna look really nice on. I feel like the girls have got the perfect balance of like getting that right. So I am so excited to try this all on now and see what it looks like. Okay, so here we have Daisy's jumper dress. This is in a size six. Josh was like in charge of all the sizing. I just told him to get me a size six unless he thought um, otherwise. So yeah, this isn't fitting very well, which obviously isn't Daisy's fault. It's the way that Pretty Little Thing have made it, but like I can't make this corset bit any tighter. So it's meant to kind of be a bit like that, I'm guessing. I haven't obviously seen a picture on the model, but I'll insert one in here so you can see what Daisy was looking at when she picked this. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking if this actually fit me, this would be so nice. Because obviously this bit would be a bit tighter. I think I'd probably want it a bit shorter, but then actually if it was tighter, it would make it shorter. But if this actually fit, I honestly think this would be so nice. I don't know if I would have picked it myself, 
But having said that, I actually love this. This is 100% something I would wear. I haven't put my Vans on with it um, just because they're downstairs. But imagine I've got some checkerboard Vans on my feet and then with the little bag, I haven't actually tried the bag out yet. I'm liking how the bag is like sat under my arm. It's not taking away too much from the dress, um, but it's just kind of there. Good size as well. We'll put my phone in. A lipstick would actually fit my like G7X vlogging camera in here as well. So that's a great little handy bag. Slots under the shoulder, perfect. I just finished filming the video and was on FaceTime with Josh to kind of tell him how it went and what I thought of the outfits. And I said to him, um, this label also fell off annoyingly. Um, but I said to him about Daisy's dress and I was like, it was just too big. Um, and then I looked at the label and I was like, wait a minute, it says it's a UK size 10. And he was like, I'm pretty sure I got you a size six. He was like, I definitely did. Then I had a look at the label and on the label it says it's a size six. So they basically, I'm just gonna kneel down because this crouching is hurting. Pretty little thing have basically put the wrong size label on the wrong dress. So that's why the dress is way too big because it's a size 10. So it's two sizes too big for me. So I apologize to Daisy for the fact that Pretty Little Thing messed up and sent the wrong size because obviously her outfit then didn't look as good as it should have because it didn't fit me properly. Next we obviously then have Eve's. Ignore my bra straps, I'm just lazy and I can't be asked to take it off. But this, I'm actually really a big fan of so it is kind of a cow neck but it's not actually like that baggy which I like because with cow necks I'm a bit I don't know I just don't like them being really baggy then this is nice and tight fits really well not too short on this but I think I prefer it if that bit was like kind of cut off I just feel like I'd wear it a bit more often if it was like this but the pattern I'm actually such a big fan of like this nude kind of navy mix I really like I don't think I would have picked this if I saw it myself on the website just because like I said it's not really the kind of normal pattern that I go for but I actually really like this like I'm so glad Eve picked this out because it just kind of shows me something different that I would normally pick but I really like if that makes sense. This little ribbony bit's here for like the ruching detail here, don't know how well that bit's showing off on camera. Um, but I quite like having that there, not too sure on the front on the bottom, just not really kind of my style but the dress like this is perfect. I have actually made it a bit shorter than it is, that is the kind of length but I tend to just pull my dresses up a bit anyway. But yeah I'm actually such a big fan of this, I really like the kind of nude colour, I think that goes quite nice with the skin and then with like the kind of bluey blotchy bits they've called it tie-dye on pretty little thing not really sure it is tie-dye it's more of like ink stains i'd kind of say but i really like it and then of course we've got hannah's the same just in a different style this one is actually a size eight rather than a six just because i think the size six was out of stock um like i said josh is in charge of sizings so yeah but it doesn't actually fit me too big or anything it still fits really nice and still nice and tight but yeah, again with this one i would probably get rid of this but either tuck it up or i could probably cut it off again it's not really a pattern i would normally pick but i do really like it like it's just a little bit more interesting than plain black but it's not too much pattern for me if that makes sense so yeah we obviously all like the dress because they both picked it and i also really like it so we just need pretty little thing to do this dress in one more kind of pattern and then we could all wear the same dress in a different like kind of patterny style thing on a night out and then we have alana's which is a very me casual kind of like day-to-day -day outfit shorts fit really nicely they're just not the best quality though just going to put that out there in case anyone wants to get any pretty little thing cycling shorts they're very see-through like where my pants are they're fine with this outfit obviously because like the top is covering most of it but they are quite see-through and I have some from Primark which are actually better quality so if anyone wants cycling shorts I'd recommend going to Primark instead of Pretty Little Thing um, just because they're better quality. I'd love if the cycling shorts were the same colour as the top but I know Pretty Little Thing don't do cycling shorts in this colour because I've tried to get them before for other t-shirts I have and it just doesn't work but still because it's like a dark grey colour it does work really well with the black and obviously Alana can't magic up a colour of cycling shorts so yeah I am a big fan of this okay so that's it for this video that was an absolute success I'm so pleased with everything they got me they did so well uh, once again thank you to the girls for picking out the outfits and everything and to dad and Josh for helping make this video possible um, I do kind of want to do another one of these in the future because it was actually so fun to film and the girls all seem to be really excited about kind of picking the outfits as well so if you want to see another one of these with maybe some other friends as well maybe some boys and stuff then give this video a thumbs up subscribe down below if you haven't already um but yeah give it a thumbs up so that i know that you enjoy it and i'll see you at some point soon in another video bye